वेलकम स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस फ्यू क्वेश्चंस फ्रॉम द चैप्टर ड्रॉप बाय ड्रॉप फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज कैन यू थिंक ऑफ वेज ऑफ सेविंग वाटर राइट योर सजेशंस बिलो सो हियर वी आर आस्क्ड व्हाट आर द डिफरेंट वेज ऑफ सेविंग वाटर एंड वी आर रिक्वायर्ड टू राइट डाउन आवर सजेशंस हियर फ्रॉम दिस पिक्चर वी सी दैट वी शुड नॉट लीव द टैप रनिंग वाइल ब्रशिंग द टीथ because when we are busy in brushing the teeth water is running from the tap and it will be wasted so that is why while brushing the teeth we should not leave the tap running from this picture we understand that water is leaking from the tap drop by drop and it will be wasted so whenever there is any leakage or damage in the tap or pipeline it should be repaired earliest it will help to stop the wastage of water similarly what are the other ways of saving water let's see first is never leave a tap open because it will waste lot of water so we should not leave the tap open second is while brushing teeth or taking shower we should not leave the tap or shower running because it will waste the water we should use it whenever it is necessary third is water left after washing clothes can be reused for washing toilets or washrooms fourth is whenever there is any leakage or damage in the tap or pipeline it should be repaired earliest it will help to stop the wastage of water now fifth thing is whenever it is possible we should recycle the water next thing is water unused water can be used for watering the plants in the garden so these were the few ways we can save the water now let's see the second question have you seen water flowing unnecessarily in your home school or any other place where so often we see that there is a leakage in tap and water is wasted drop by drop so if there is any leakage it should be repaired earliest to stop the wastage of water next is here few boxes are given and we are required to join them according to their relation one example is already shown here what is the example given washing fruits and vegetables and it is connected to watering plants means the water left after washing fruits and vegetables can be reused for watering the plants in the garden similarly washing clothes the water left after washing clothes can be reused for washing the toilets or washing the or mopping the floor outside the home next is washing hands and face so water left after washing hands and face can be reused for washing the toilets or can be used in toilets so these were the few questions in the from the chapter drop by drop thank you for watching